So before we even get into this video, guys, uh, we need to talk about something. We lost a value member of our Pokeballer Luke team. <laughs> Rest in peace, Alolan Vulpix. Yeah, guys, I got rid of Alolan Vulpix as the mascot, but I also got this new awesome art by Prince of Spirits on DeviantArt. I'll link his DeviantArt profile in the description. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this, and without further ado, let's play the video, baby. So it's time we address the elephant in the room. And no, I'm not talking about my forehead. Thank you very much. But we're going to talk about the worst meme that has ever been a part of my channel. How's it going, guys? My name is Luke. And the background game, of course, is not Pokemon. It is, in fact, the new Infinite Warfare beta. So if you don't want to see this, you know, you can just, like, put on headphones and listen. But, you know, whatever. Who cares, right? Today, we're going to talk about... A meme that has overcome part of my channel. And uh, it's not negative, really, but it I don't know. I just feel like we should make a video talking about it. So if you guys aren't familiar with my series Poke Quiz, that wouldn't make a lot of sense because that's about all I upload anymore. But yeah, Poke Quiz, if you don't know, is a series where I ask you guys a Pokemon-related question and you guys leave your creative answers responses in the comment section below and I pick my favorite to make stupid jokes about in the next video. Yeah, that's that's basically uh, what that's basically what it's about. But throughout the uh, throughout the 24 weeks or so, Poke Quiz has been out. There's been a good amount of inside jokes between myself and the viewers. Obviously, it's a very interactive series since I'm basically replying to comments on video. And there's been some some funny inside jokes, such as how everyone hates Pikachu. That one kind of died out slowly. Uh, and then there was also like everyone bashes on Squirtle because it's my mascot. Ha ha ha. But th then there's some not so great ones like uh, um the one we're gonna be talking about today, and that of course, guys, is Gardevoir. A lot of you probably are thinking right now, like, huh, Luke, what's wrong with Gardevoir? It's just a Pokemon. Yeah, it is just a Pokemon. I agree with you, but uh, th 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 there's some people on the deep uh, the deep internet that uh, they they don't agree with you. To them, it's it's more of a sexual figure, which is not something I, I agree with or or I endorse by any means. But you know, if you look at Gardevoir, it does clearly you know resemble a female. It, it's more of a feminine-looking Pokemon. And despite that, its gender ratio is actually 50-50, but I'm gonna stop talking about gender real quick because the last time I did that, I got bashed by Tumblr social justice warriors. And though they're really, really stupid, I, I just don't have the time and energy to mess with that. But there's been an ongoing joke in Poke Quiz where people basically leave comments about sexualizing a Gardevoir, no matter what the question is. What Pokemon would you like to ride in battle? Oh, I'd like to ride a Gardevoir. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my god, I'm six years old. Th that's basically what the comments are like. And I want you guys to know, I'm not bashing on you. And if anything, I appreciate that we're close enough to where there are running inside jokes on my channel. Like, that is awesome. Not every YouTuber can say that they have jokes that, like, with their audience like that. And it just shows that, you know, my channel is pretty interactive, I'd say. But, but you know, I I'm making myself blush, right? Like, my channel's great. I, I already know this. There's no need to talk about it anymore. But yeah, I'm not bashing on you guys, because I know that a lot of these jokes are ironic. But a lot of people seem to really hate them. So I figured that today, I'd dedicate a video to those haters. We are going to go through every single Gardevoir joke made on Poke Quiz ever. And, uh, yeah, that's basically what we're about to jump into. So if you guys, you know, if you guys are ready, make sure uh, you're, you're cringing. Just do that pre-cringe, because you're gonna need that, trust me. And, uh, yeah, remember to take it lightheartedly. It's not too serious. Obviously, I'm just being ironic, and most of the comments are probably being ironic as well. No one actually thinks this way about a freaking Pokemon. But yeah, without further ado, here it is. And finally, I bring Gardevoir because... Because why? I don't get it. Oh my god, you're a disgusting pervert. I name my Gardevoir's Rule 34. No explanation needed. Gardevoir so it can distract my co-workers and boss so I can flee. You, you guys are freaking weirdos, man. I would eat Gardevoir if you know what I'm saying. I, <laughs> stop. Gardevoir if you know- Stop! Just stop. Please, just stop. God, you guys all need to stop. 
Fucking weirdos, man. Well, I guess it's that time of day to go to PokeQuiz and check out the comments to make the next video. Oh boy, I sure am excited. Let's just scroll down and see what we have. Oh, okay, that's fun. Ah, oh, I like that one. What? What? No. Goodbye. 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 Previously on Pokey Quiz. Well, I guess it's that time of day to go to Pokey Quiz and check out the comments to make the next video. What? I would bring Honage to real life so I can kill myself because you removed my comment. Heh, <laughs> lol. And finally, I'd bring Gallade to real life because this Gardevoir joke is overused. <laughs> you know, it honestly warms my heart to see how much you guys have been changing. In the beginning, people were just posting Gardevoir jokes for attention and because I would feature them and make fun of them. But now, a lot of you guys are fighting back saying that you wish Gardevoir or Ralts didn't exist. And I'm really proud of you guys, and I think we're finally on the path to make Poke Quiz great again. Thank you. Wait a second, what the f*** is this? Who's, who would say that? Why would someone, can someone tell me why someone would say that ever? That's terrible. Uh, it, no, good, yeah, goodbye. Goodbye, we're done here. And finally, Gardevoir, because she will use Flash, if you know what I mean. Oh, I get it, like, it, she'll flash a giant light, and, like, a lot of us will go blind. That's pretty smart. I like the way you're thinking. What Pokemon would you want to survive on an island with? Leave your answers in the comment section below, and before you even comment it, just don't put a Gardevoir joke, that's disgusting. I would want to be on an island with Gallade, because I'm homosexual. And lastly, the best reply that I got in the entire comment section is... Luke is thick. What, you guys, you guys like wanted a, an answer that actually answers the question? I, I liked the last one though, I thought that it was meaningful, it, it made me blush. You know, okay, alright, I'll give you, I'll give you guys a, I'll give you guys a funny one, here's a funny one. Uh, I would be stranded with a Gardevoir so we could repubulate sorry Luke uh, I'm sorry I, don't be sorry I'm sorry for your terrible 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 learning disability I mean repubulate what the fuck does that even mean jinx 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 and jinx come on guys guard for jokes are getting old yeah and like when you look at it like jinx isn't that bad either like I'm just saying <laughs> I would have squirtle Noivern, Vanillux, Galvantula, Vaporeon, and Mimikyu, because those are my favorite Pokemon. If you wanted a joke comment, I'd have three Gardevoirs for purposes and three Pikachu for brutal murder. God, you guys are just being mean today. I identify as a Lopunny because I'm a slutty bitch. So is Lopunny just going to be like the new Gardevoir or something? I, I don't know. I would like Lopunny as a pet because Gardevoir went old. I cannot believe you guys are just throwing Gardevoir away in the trash like it was nothing. Like, it was the main meme on this show for like, for like, the first 20 episodes. I would have Gardevoir so I wouldn't have to buy a doll. I'ma keep doing this until I get featured XD. Okay, well, that was just, that was just f***ing awful. I'm, I'm really sorry that you guys had to endure that, but I feel like you guys probably enjoyed it as well. Because I know I enjoyed making that montage. But yeah, in the end, I don't think these jokes need to stop. But eventually, it probably will die out completely and be replaced with another inside joke, because that's how it works on my channel. But yeah, I just thought it'd be fun to kind of recap all those moments. So that's going to be the video, guys. Remember to leave a comment telling me which Pokemon you don't want to have sex with. And uh, with that out of the way, I guess, uh, yeah. <laughs> Make sure you guys have it. That was the fakest laugh I've ever done. <laughs> Ooh, ha, ha. Real laughs right here, guys. With that... 
out of the way. I hope you all had a fantastic day. But most importantly, make sure you brush your teeth, guys. Like, you're not trying to get no cavities. Like, I know how it is. I've had a few cavities before, like one or two. And it sucks, so make sure you brush your teeth. And, uh, yeah, have a great day. And like and subscribe so I can feed my pet grasshopper. I have a pet grasshopper, yes. But, yeah, I need to buy more grasshopper food, guys, so I'm going to get going. Peace out.